in Joel chapter 3 verses 14 and 15 it says multitudes multitudes in the valley of decision for the day of the Lord is near in the valley of decision the sun and the moon shall be darkened and the stars shall withdraw their shining so I have a couple thoughts on this one is I have heard the phrase the valley of decision and so this is one of the verses that that comes from and I think that it's an interesting way to think about um, where we are right now in our life it's a we're in a valley in our life where we get to decide whether we're going to follow the Lord or not and then the day of the Lord there's this is a reoccurring prophecy that the sun and the moon shall be darkened and the stars shall withdraw their shining this prophecy is already being fulfilled um, uh, through light pollution and through some other things we the the stars compared to what Joel saw we have many fewer stars the average person sees a lot fewer stars um, than than what Joel saw the stars have fallen from the sky they are withdrawing their shining um, compared to Joel's time and I'm not sure about the Sun and the moon being darkened that might be the case too I could easily see pollution causing that but um, or some sort of intervention with global warming. They've talked about doing something to block sunlight um, with global warming. So maybe something like that will happen and fulfill that prophecy, but the stars have started to withdraw their shining.